What if your pet could help solve a murder? Okay, maybe not your typical house pet, but a parrot actually helped solve a mystery in 2015 when a Michigan woman took her husband's life in front of his pet parrot named Bud. After the police showed up on the scene, Bud kept repeating a man's screams and a couple arguing. The parrot later repeated the words, don't shoot, in the victim's voice. It turned out he was mimicking his owner's final moments, but not only was it horrifying for the investigators, Bud's words actually helped them figure out what happened. A prosecutor in Michigan considered using the parrot as evidence in the trial, but it was later dismissed because they didn't think a bird would be called to the stand to testify. But this might make you think, what if the next banana you buy is actually worth $120,000? Huh? In a stunt that shocked the art world, a literal banana taped to a wall titled Comedian sold for six figures and it didn't sell for only once but actually twice. The artwork itself is really a certificate that you own the art and even instructions how to recreate the piece since, you know, bananas start going bad quite fast. This controversial piece spark debates about what qualifies as art, the value we place on everyday objects, and perhaps even the absurdity of the art market itself. So the next time you go to a store, just think about ever sent a text with a typo and edited it before anyone noticed? Well, that wasn't possible for the engineers who lost a $125 million space probe to Mars, all because of a missing hyphen. It turns out different units of measurement were used in the calculations, leading to disaster. This mishap serves as a stark reminder that even the most advanced technology can be brought down by the smallest mistakes. Ever been late to somewhere? Maybe you have lost your wallet once? Well, that's a valid reason for having a bad day, but I'd say Napoleon had it a bit worse. To celebrate a victory in 1807, Napoleon planned a rabbit hunt, but his men bought tame rabbits. Now, wild ones like they should have. When released, the rabbits didn't run away like Napoleon planned, but swarmed him in hopes of food. After a while of struggling, Napoleon got into his carriage and eventually escaped the raving rabbits. We can't be sure if Napoleon celebrated with rabbit hunts after that, but there are no public records of him throwing a party like this again. So if you have... When we think of insane rulers, a few names come to mind, but Emperor Caligula makes them all look like choir boys. This guy wasn't just power hungry, he was bat crap crazy. Want examples? He appointed his favorite horse as a senator, basically living the plot of a bad comedy. He threw lavish parties for himself while his people were starving. Oh, and remember that war on the sea? Yeah, his soldiers stabbed the waves and triumphantly collected seashells as loot. Caligula was the original wildcard, proving that absolute power corrupts absolutely and sometimes hilariously. Imagine you're strolling through a park. You see a cat and two men on a bench. Everything seems normal. Wrong! That cat is a CIA spy listening in on secret Soviet chatter. This might sound crazy, but it's true. In the 1960s, the height of the Cold War, the CIA had a truly wild idea. Turn cats into the ultimate spies. They surgically implanted a microphone in a cat's ear canal and a radio transmitter at the base of its skull. A thin wire was installed from the cat's head to tail and acted as an antenna. The CIA spent about 20 million on this feline espionage program and what was their first mission? Eavesdropping on two men in a park outside the Soviet embassy in Washington DC. Unfortunately, our furry agent's instincts took over. The cat got distracted by something and wandered into the street only to be hit by a passing taxi. But here's the surprising twist to the story. The cat survived the collision. After surviving the near-fatal crash, a second surgery was done to remove his high-tech spy gear. And against all odds, this resilient feline recovered from the surgery and went on to live a long and happy life as a normal house cat after that. Project Acoustic Kitty might have been a flop, but it's a hilarious reminder of the lengths intelligence agencies will go to for an edge against the competition. It also shows that even top secret missions can be derailed by the simple, unpredictable nature of our feline friends. 
Would you keep it? A woman found $36,000 inside a couch she got from Craigslist. She thought the couch felt a bit hard on one spot, and after checking the pillows, turns out they were full of envelopes filled with cash that the previous owner had hidden. The woman didn't want to just take it all, so she informed the seller and returned the money. The seller gave her $2,200 as a reward. Would you return it or 